good morning everybody welcome to day 169 Whew. workouts done um, it's a beautiful morning here actually a little cooler today than it was yesterday a little less humid I'm not sure what happened we didn't really have a rain or a front come through but I'll take it anyway Oh, yesterday was a great day. You guys saw that. I uh, got to meet a couple new people, Tim and Lisa. It was great meeting you. Got to go out to eat with my wife and my oldest daughter. And then uh, we went and hung out on the beach to watch the sunset. So it was, uh, I'd say, all in all a good day. Now we have three days. So we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday morning. We head to Anniston, Alabama for the event this weekend. And we'll be gone Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. I think we're coming back Tuesday. and will be our last leg of the trip because mama birthday, mama birthday, <laughs> mama badger's birthday is Sunday. So um, we're going to celebrate her birthday. We're going to go hang out on the beach some more and uh, just uh, kind of enjoy life a little bit. Take it a little slower coming home, spend some time uh, just chilling and uh, celebrating her birthday. So it only comes around once a year we might as well celebrate it and uh, have a good time so anyway that leaves us three days to get everything caught up and wrapped up so that we can be gone for those days and not be you know really stressed about it on the road uh, because uh, that makes it less fun if we're stressed about did we get that done did we get this done we need to stop and do this so we're going to try to avoid that this trip and uh, just get stuff done so that means i need to get to work but first i need to get the coffee so we'll see you and a few. All right, y'all. It's mail time. That sounds like Blue's Clues. Mail time. Anyway, I got a box back here. That was the winner of today's drawing. I have a couple of Gremlin Bells that were ordered over the weekend. They've got to go. And then I got a message that I have a package. And I didn't order anything, so I don't know what the package is. So we're going to go figure out what the package is, get this stuff shipped off, and we're going to take Silver for a ride because I've only took Silver around the block, and I did all that front end work. So I put new bearings, and I put in the new fork seal, and of course you got to take the brakes and all apart. So I just kind of went to make sure that I'm going to ride it as much as I can before Thursday because uh, I don't want to find out something's wrong going 90 down 75 i mean what's the speed limit 80 or 70 whatever the speed limit is that's how fast i'm going down i-75 so anyway um we're gonna go see what we can get uh, accomplished here at the post office So we got everything dropped off and shipped. Got a package from Freeman Maps. Um, I remember Mama, or Grandma Badger, actually talking about, um, this guy reached out and he donated some stuff for the Route 66 ride. And I'm assuming they are like maps, um, but I'm not sure, I haven't opened it yet. So we're gonna go home, we'll open it up, and uh, we'll show you what we got. All these cool donations to give away to the riders of Route 66. Whew! It's been a Monday for sure. Tonight is going to be a late night. So, Baby Badger is coming back from Missouri tonight. She's flying in. Her flight is um, scheduled to arrive at 8.30. Baby Badger lives two hours from us. So 9.30, 10.30 before we get her to her house. You guys watched a couple weeks ago where she brought me her car and I fixed a right rear tire. Well, just before she left, she said, my tire indicator light came back on. So I'm gonna say that um, her tire is leaking. <sighs> you guys know that I bought a new tire plug kit thing that I thought was like super awesome and super easy to install. Well, I will say this much. Here they are, the little screw plugs. Anyway, 
I will say this much for them. They are super easy to install. I tried to fix the Jeep tire with it and I tried to fix her tire. Um, out of two tires, um, tried to fix it. They've installed easily and failed on both. So I am of the mind that these are complete and total utter junk. Unless you were like on your bike and you just needed to plug it to get to town, um, I don't think that these are worth a shit. So um, I will not be using these anymore. I'll go back to the old plugs. I've used those for 40 years. They've worked for 40 years, never had an issue with them. So I think I'll just stick with what works um, and uh, forget the new technology. See what happens when I go to new stuff? That's why I drive old trucks, old bikes, old cars, old Jeeps, because the new stuff just doesn't fucking work. <laughs> Anyway, so um, about an hour we're going to go pick up Baby Badger, then we're going to go up. I've got uh, my impact, I'm taking my compressor, so I'll go up there, I will pull her rear tire, rear wheel off, I will fix her rear tire, I will air it up, and hopefully send her down the road. I want her to just stay the night tonight, but I guess she's got something going on tomorrow, so we literally got to take her home. So if it takes me half an hour to fix it, that gets me home at, I don't know, one in the morning. And then of course I'm going to edit this video. So um, it's going to be a late night for me for sure, but it is what it is. Welcome to my life. So here in a bit, we're going to go get Baby Badger from the airport and then we're going to head to St. Pete and fix the tire. I guess you guys can go along with us. Enjoy. parking garage airing up the tire I put old regular plugs in there because the new screwy ones didn't work but I got it fixed now I'm just literally waiting for it to air up I'll put it back on our car and she'll run on down the road and we'll be home at I don't know one o'clock in the morning or so what's that bike. oh and mama badgers finally got keys for her bike that she left in Missouri so yeah, remember me telling you these little air compressors? They're awesome. So now it's airing up this tire. I always carry them on the bike because they work on the bike. They work on the bike better than they work on the car. Um, but uh, anyway, it's gonna be a late night. But at least it's fixed. Baby Badger's home. So now she can get all of her stuff wrapped up because she needs to be moved out of her place before we leave June 28th. So she's got a lot to do and a little time to do it. All right, guys, we'll catch you later. All right, we are home. Desi is home. It's 12.15. Hey, welcome to Tuesday. Anyway, I'm going to edit this video, get it up, and uh, it'll be up in like just a few short hours. Now, whether I'll be up in a few short hours working out, that is still to be decided. But anyway, let's get this done so I can go to bed. We'll see you, well, in a few hours.